God is able. And when y'all look back over my life, if y'all want to look back over you know, I got to give them glory. So give them glory. chapter um, verse uh, 43, 18th chapter of the first Kings and we're going to be looking at the 18th chapter verse 43 verse 43 first Kings the 18th chapter verse 43 when you have it, say thank you, Jesus. And the Bible reads the story. He said to his servant, Go up now, look toward the sea. And he went up, and looked and said, There's nothing. And he said, Go again. Seven times. 
And it came to pass at the seventh time that he said, Behold, there arise a little cloud out of the sea like a man's hand. And he said, Go up and say to Ahab, Prepare thou shalt and get thee down that the rain stop thee not. The Bible says in verse 44, and it came to pass at the seventh time that he said, Behold, there arrived a little cloud out of the sea like a man's hand. And I want to use one of all before we leave you here tonight. And carry you going in 2020 with the dog, can you see it? Look at your neighbor and say, Neighbor! Can you see it? Come on and give God a hand of praise. And when I found out, my brother and my sister, that we can never despise the day of small things. But we hope and we wait for great things to come from the Almighty God. But when we would consider small beginnings, and some will look around and say, we are so small beginnings. But what we look at is a small beginning. God can do a great thing with it. And God can bring some great things out of it. And God has already spoken it in our lives and over this house of God. And how many know that he's able to bring the past in your life? If you trust him in here, you're able to bring it to the past. So you got to believe it. You got to wait on it. You got to watch for it. Look at somebody say, watch for it. And you will see it come to pass in your life in 2020. We decree and declare that this is going to be a blessed year. We're going to walk highly favored, y'all. Is everybody declaring and declaring and speaking the life over your situation and over everything that you have? That this will be a blessed year. We walk in God's favor and prosperity. We walk in 2020. Watch God do a new thing in our life. How do we that God can do it in here? How do you know? Look at somebody and say, Look. look. The question is, can you see it? I see it. 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 And so we look at that when we look at the, our scripture. We understand Elijah is that he's done with some things. He did with some things. And so what God is doing, we watch Elijah. He, we watch him move and deal with the process of it. He tells him, come on, come on, come on. Y'all get up there and y'all call on your God. And I'm going to call on my God. And so they build some altars and they cut, and, they, and he said, I'll tell you what, I'm, y'all ain't got it. So I'm alone, y'all, so you have them, and we're going to cut them, and we're going to have them all them. And what you do is whoever God answers first, <laughs> that would be the God of the land. And all of a sudden, they get in the call on that God, they're cutting their teeth, and, 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 and Elijah picks at him, he says, look, 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 maybe you need to call a little louder. Maybe she. And they get a call on the God that they serve. And all of a sudden, nothing happened. But Elijah stands up in the midst of all of these men by himself. And sometimes you got to understand, it looks like the odds always against you. Oh, yeah. right. Elijah on the common, these are the, it's 850 pounds of bell, and it's one Elijah. Sometimes it's going to look like in 2020 that the odds are not always in your favor. Right. <laughs> but how do you understand that God specializes in missions that are impossible? Because we have one. So you understand, one person can stand up and make a difference. Yes. We look at the heaven here. We got enough right here to turn the stand upside down. Yes. And we're staring at 2020. Look at the heaven here. The God can do number one. How many of you think you can do with us as we touch and agree? Come together and say, God, have your way in our life. Yeah. Yeah. Go ahead, man, here. And so, on. and so he gets up there and he calls on the name of God. And all of a sudden, fire comes down the hill. Because God is God. Yes, sir. It's nothing too hard for him. It's nothing that you can't. So the first thing I want you to understand is going into 2020, you gotta have a prayer life. The Bible says in James 5 and 7, Elijah was a man with a nature like ours, and he prayed fervently that it might not rain. And for three years and six months, it did not rain on the earth. So what James goes on and says in 5.16, called be the effective, fervent prayer of a righteous man. Amen. 
uh, uh, sometimes uh, 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 when you have to do something and they ain't doing it like you like uh, and it ain't happening fast enough, amen, attitude starts from Don't say that to me. I did it one time and it happened. Don't say that to me. Don't talk to me. Don't ask me no more. <laughs> but you got to be persistent. That's right. He said, not only one time, two times, three times, four times, five times, oh, look at the number six times, but on the seventh time, y'all hear me? Seventh time, he went up there and he said, I, he had to look at it. It looks like in his mind, when he got up there, he expected to see nothing. Uh, right, right. Every time you go to God and pray, every time you walk another step, every time you make a next adventure in your life, you got to expect God. Now look at preacher, I see something. Uh -huh. <laughs> I see something. It's like it looks like a little cloud coming up over the sea. And, and, and over the sea. Y'all know I know I know the wild from younger. Nowhere. Uh -huh. Sometimes God will just show up out. Y'all ain't gonna help me. <laughs> you don't think I know when you're gonna come, you better come when you wanna come. But he's still a long time God. He will show up out of nowhere when you think it's all over. When you think it's, it's dead and gone, when you think it's through and you wanna go in the time, he will show up out of nowhere. Anybody here ever understand and touch a lot of me that God will show up just right on time? Yes, yes, Look at somebody and say, Won't he do it? Won't he do it? Show up. He'll show up. He goes seven times. He's persistent. If you're going to reach, reach your goal in 2020, if the church is going to reach its goal in 2020, you got to be persistent. Yes, sir. And man, you got to keep the course. Even though you got some haters, you're going to have to stay the course. Yes. You're going to have some naysayers, you're going to stay the course. Yes. Even they're going to talk about you, you got to stay the course. Yes. But how many know the Lord will make a way somehow? Yes, he will. And I made up in my mind, I'm running till I'm finished. There's a time I start running, and all of a sudden I hit some stumbling block, and I get a little slow, and get a little tired, and I sit on the corner. But this year, 2020, y'all go ahead. I'm pinning my head back, and I'm running with my eyes up, looking unto God, y'all go ahead. Is anybody going looking unto God today? How many that only your help comes from the Lord? All you got to do is look to the Lord and say, look, look, look to the hills. Knowing all of your help. Come from the Lord. God will give you a vision. Sometimes, you know, I, I, I'm a little older. I mean, y'all, I tell y'all, just holler, holler at your boy. Happy birthday. Amen. And y'all holler at your boy. Happy birthday. Then what that mean to me? I got another year older. Amen. But I feel another year younger. Y'all All right, all right. Sometimes, what I feel. And if I don't always mess up. Good day. Miss Mom got the wrong vibe. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I try to play it off. And them little words, all of a sudden, they're like, you know, one big line. I remember when I used to just pick it up and just read it.
You got to persevere. You got to keep on pressing on. And then all of a sudden, as we look at it, we saw that there, the servant kept on going. And the seventh time he got there, he said, hold up. <laughs> I ain't seen that all the time, but now I just keep on looking. And I see something. How many God can strengthen your faith when God just give you a little glimpse of something? Again, number three, number four, he gives you provision for your vision. God didn't give us no vision without already having provision. I know the bank account might not say it, but God has already spoken it over our life. All we got to do is walk in his favor. Provision. The cloud. Now, 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 notice, let me back up so you can get the story. So, I, I, he, Elijah prays uh -huh. for a trial. Y'all, yeah. y'all, uh -huh. ever been in the cloud? Yeah. Well, it looked like you were losing more than what you were getting. Uh -huh. A trial. Uh -huh. One thing is dry. <laughs> a trial. I, I know I'm supposed to go to church, uh -huh. but I don't feel like it. Yeah. Uh -huh. I, 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 I start out praying. In January 2019. Yeah. Uh -huh. December 2019, all I can do is say, Lord, thank you. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. My pride. Because sometimes we feel like you in a trap. Thirsty for something, but you ain't getting nothing. And sometimes there's discouraging in your life. But you got to trust God that He'll provide for you in the midst of it. Some of us was employed, and now we ain't no more employed. That's right. Sometimes you have some money, all of a sudden bills got to go ahead. The light bill went up higher than what you expected. And now, when you have a little extra, you get caught up. Yeah. 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 And so the same man that prayed and said, don't pray, because God going to teach you something. Yeah. He goes on his knees and said, God, I'm praying for him. All right. And now all of a sudden, a cloud for us showed up. God starts providing. He is going to provide you like he is. You can't beat God. He is going to provide you. He's going to provide your needs according to his riches and glory in Christ Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. And then not only that, and so not only you gotta understand in 2020, God gonna give you provision yes, he will. for your vision, yes. Yes, he even will. in your, your personal life. But then He start pouring of the rain. Hmm. All right. What you mean to pour? In verse 45, it said a great rain came. Uh -huh. And how know that everything God do is great? And anytime God starts pouring, that's gonna be an overflow in your life. And ain't nobody understand that God can do exceeding and abundant above more than you can ever have or think in your life. God can bring about a whole book flow. Think of somebody said, let it rain. Right. God needs you to pour out the rain. Now. And ain't nobody looking to him and you see it. It's raining on me. Think of somebody said, Lord, I'm touching. Pour it out. Now you know what I'm saying? I'm going to tell you that. What do you want to say? See it, number one. You gotta understand. Not only now, to see it, you gotta believe it. You gotta believe it. Shout it back, Kevin. You gotta believe it. You gotta believe it. Number two, you just can't believe it. You gotta receive it. Gotta believe it. Because somebody said you gotta receive it. Gotta receive it. And then number three, you got to achieve it. Gotta because it. you gotta achieve it. Gotta that means when you receive it, that means you gotta do something. Because somebody said do something with God. Now then, as I get ready to leave, got 10 more minutes. Time of 2020. My future word is look. Well, look at what? I see the A's. There it is. The hell means you just really can't just look at it. But you got the lock on it. That means that you got to learn how to focus on the vision that God has for you. In your life, there's going to be some distractions. There's some things that's going to get in your mind or something. But you got to learn how to lock your vision on the almighty God.
the flood hey. 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 